Alright, welcome back to uh, F1 Manager 2022, uh, Making Williams Great, uh, Part 7. This is the uh, Canadian Grand Prix is where we left off. I just need a quick refresher here because I don't remember... It's It's been a while. I just want to see how we stack up against Austin Martin. Okay, see, we are starting to catch up. Um, nobody has any points. No, they do not. Um, design Center in 31 days. Wind Tunnel in 49 days. And we don't have enough to upgrade the uh, CFD. I think it's 10 million. Yeah, 10 million for the CFD. We should have enough by the end of this race. And uh, that'll give us a huge advantage. Alright, so anyway, on to uh, the Canadian Grand Prix. Formula One is oh. back in Montreal. Let's hope it's not going to be Groundhog Day. The local rodents have disrupted more than one race day here in the past. The Canadian Grand Prix... Alright, well, it's raining, which is, you know, it's Canada. It's not surprising. Um... Oops, wrong car. Um, I guess you can... What's the... Let me just go back here. Race day is light rain. Um, but can I see the actual... Okay, I can't see the actual, like, breakdown of when, how, and where. Uh, so I guess we'll, we'll just leave them on uh, wets for now and it, we'll figure it out later. I don't know, it, it depends on uh, how wet it is as well. So, 5%. So that one's useless now. Alright, 4, 12, 2, 8, 3, 10, it's already at 3, 10, 6, 5. We'll give him tons of fuel. Same as always on super crybaby slow mode. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, we just added two new parts to the car, I think? But uh, again, it's it's been quite some time since the last uh, video, so I, I, don't, I don't know. Um, okay, well that one's got the little driver symbol, so that's not new. Um, Okay, I guess we don't have any new parts. Like I said, it's been a while. I can't be expected to remember everything. At this rate, I'm just going to end up deleting the uh, other save file. This one's going to get exactly where this one is. Radio check. Radio check. Radio check. It's green now. And he can go since he touched the line. Alright. 
I have uh, been playing the new one. I, I know it's fine. Don't worry about it. And uh, I, d I do like a lot of the new things they added. Um, in particular, I like that they actually added a staff member who manages the pit crew. So that's, you know, I like that. And the uh, the mood of the drivers, which, you know, makes sense. Because obviously they're going to get more frustrated with the worst they perform. And less frustrated with the better they perform. So, uh... Oh no, I, I do like it. Uh, I don't really understand the new level system. It seems to just go up however, whenever. I, I don't know. Maybe their skills increase with usage or whatever, but... By the way, it's still fun. How does it feel? 40%? Yo, what the... Well, uh, let's bring him in then. What's your thoughts on coming in or doing any more? Yeah, he's 81, so I don't know why he's... They, got, they both got the exact same setup. Well, uh... Can you hurry up and get there? Thank you. Alright, well, um... Holy crap, baskets! it's all bad except one. Alright, so great, and then all bads. Um, I think they're too low, but I'm just going to leave it at bads because I'm not 100%. And then light set up. 4, 13, 4, Whoops, wrong way. Four six, twenty and thirty five. Oh, I don't have to. Oh no 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 no! I want more than just fifteen laps. Um, he's eighty one, so he can uh, go ahead and just stay out and uh, work on his track acclimation. Because he'll have 100% by uh, P3 anyway. I mean, assuming there's no crashes or anything. So we'll have uh, the whole practice session pretty well to get him to 100% set up. And since uh, Frederick here maxes out at 500 XP, there's no point not to uh, try to get the setup better. Um, okay, why did you go time zone speed? Nothing seems to have happened. Okay, well, anyway, I don't know what that was, but, uh... Oh, maybe it was because the rain stopped? And the game was just being weird because of the uh, speed up. I don't know, hard to say. We'll uh, just continue onward and go from there. It's fine. They, they can stay out. Don't worry about it. You're driving crybaby slow anyway, it's not a problem. Come on, four to five, hurry up. What do you 
Think? What the? Come on, man. Oh, I think I it. Yeah, that's gotta be user error. Um, no, it's it, okay. No, oh, I've got it set on the right game. Um, I don't know what to tell you. I thought maybe I had it um, set for the new game, but uh, I just checked and I don't. So I'm not sure what kind of uh, shenanigans is going on there, but uh, it's too late to bother changing his setup because we won't get any feedback. Fine, don't worry about it. Just get your 60%. That's all I care about right now. Good session. Alright, so that's P1 down. Um, and I guess it's good weather, so... I'll just put him on hearts since we didn't use hearts on the first. All right. Um. Good and then uh, three greats. Another good. Fence it up. Five, thirty-seven, two ninety, and thirty. That looks pretty good, yeah. Um, I do like how they changed the um, finding the setups in the new one. Better than uh, this game, if I'm being honest, because they uh, the closer you get with your first guess the more the uh, bars narrow down. So, I mean, uh, I, I do like that much better. Um, all the same as last time, all greats and uh, the rest bad. Let's try again. Up to 14, down to 6.4, up to 30, and then down to 0.5. That is all the way not correct. I, I can tell just by looking at it. Um, I don't know what's going on here. Why are you giving me such weird feedbacks? Just uh, try to shimmy it myself here. See what kind of shenanigans I can get going on. Oh, that way, please. You that way. Okay. A little bit better. Or at least, you know, it, it appears a little bit better anyway. Um, that we could. We need the, yeah, we need the straights to be like there. Let's, let's try that. See how that works. At least that's within the bars, and then we'll just uh, then we'll just go from there. Okay, he's on super crybaby slow mode, so he's fine. Drop a save just in case. You never know. All right, and then we'll uh, we'll get Hogger out first, since 
for some reason his setup's being weird. Alright, there you can go now as well. As long as you didn't hurt the car, I don't really care. No, you didn't hurt the car, you're fine. Speaking of hurting the car, um, my very first race and the uh, practice sessions and whatnot in uh, F1 Manager 2023, they, uh, uh, the first one, Logan wrecked out, and then the second practice session, Hogger wrecked out, and then uh, I believe somebody bumped us in P3. It was it was a real expensive practice session. So that was my start to uh, on oh, competitor. Okay, so hopefully it didn't involve us. Nope, didn't involve us. We're fine. He just locked up, he's fine. Front wing's busted. Not a huge deal. I'm hoping that that uh, setup will be more sufficient, but uh Okay, we got uh, multiple cars crashing. Hopefully, we weren't involved in that. And it does not appear that we were. Let's have a look. So let's look at this. There's Sergio Perez. And there's the hit. Oh, we were almost involved in it. Alright, well, you know, I'm fine with it. We weren't involved in it. Oh, uh, you know, he's out, so. Sucks for his race weekend, I guess. Oh, oh, he told us about the car, and I didn't even notice it. Uh, so 75. How's the balance? Uh, so clearly what I did improved things. Um, we'll leave him out for now just so he can get at least 60% track acclimation and then we'll worry about it next session. So we still have all of P3. Sixty-eight? Come on, man. That's worse. I don't know what is going on with the app right now, but uh, I don't know. Maybe the update for the new game uh, messed it up. I don't know. Or who knows? It could very well be just me, you know, somehow screwing it up. That's all right. I'll uh, I'll just mess around with Logan's setup a little bit, like I did with Hoggers, and we'll uh, we'll see. Other way, I'm pretty sure you only need uh, 80, I think it is. 80 or 85 for the uh, full 3 bonus. Yeah, 
Yeah, so we'll just, uh, we'll just mess around with it. See how it, uh, works out. Level 16, yeah, it'll be fine for this weekend. Damn, it's one of those weekends, I guess. Um, not us, so I'm fine. Sounds like there's been contact. Here's the replay. Okay, so there we have the LP. And that's a big smash. It's rugged. He just decided to, uh, Touch him real hard. Oh, hey, that's good for us. Stroll's out. So, uh... They're our, uh, competition. Or our biggest competition, rather, right now. So, uh, it's good for us. Well, I mean, I say that, but I, honestly, I, I, I still have no idea whether, uh... The AI is subject to the same requirements as you. You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't know if they have uh, actual track acclimation and set up confidence and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So who knows? Maybe it doesn't help at all. Same with the get like business side of it. I'm not sure if they have a budget like you do, or if it's just like an infinite budget, or you know what I mean. Like it's. Hello and thank you for joining us as our race weekend unfolds. Free practice is nearly done. Anyway, uh, P3. Uh, so. I don't know what's going on with your setup here. Okay, well they're still within the line, so maybe his is fine. It's just. Um, so good, good, great, good, and then bad. Uh, we'll give the uh, we'll give that one more chance to fix it, and then I'll just wing it. Um, yeah, that that looks all right. I'll trust the app. Um, I guess we'll just eat them on mediums. No point not to. You know, small mediums. Alright, and then for you, sir, let me. Six five. Uh, I have to reset the app and put in the actual setup I put. Two eight. Two eight five. And then all the way. All right, there we go. Uh, good, good. Great, good. And great. Fine setup. Alright, it says 8, 11, 5 stays the same. It says up to 1, 9, down to 2, 8, down to 7, 5. Uh, there we go. Okay, well, maybe looks like me faffing around with it actually uh, made it figure itself out. See what it says. Either way, though, we have, you know, at least adequate enough setups to not really worry too bad about it. Ready to check? Ready to check. Uh, to be fair, I, I have done a little bit of testing where I uh, tried to get fired on purpose just to see, like, how much I could screw up before they actually fired me. And I raced with really bad setups, and it, it really wasn't super terrible.
I mean, obviously, it wasn't, you know, good by any measure. But, could have been worse. Alright, so hopefully he'll get enough uh, experience to at least get to 90% track acclimation. But of course it depends on the setup. This is the last practice session, so we, we gotta try to get it right now. I mean, we can use Q1 as a uh, test if it's, you know, if it's close. Obviously, we would prefer to finish it here and then uh, go into cube one with a good setup. Someone spun out. What's your thoughts on coming in or doing any more? Why, man? Why is it worse? I don't understand. All the apps being weird on me, I guess, so... Um, well, I mean, we've got one optimal, I guess, so, uh... I mean, highest confidence is 81, so we, we can just, we'll give the app another go, see what it says. You are bad. Um, you are good. Optimal. And then great, great. Alright, so it says 3.5. Well, stays the same, 2.8 stays the same, down to 3.10, and up to 5.5. Five. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty good. Alright, let's try that. 81, well... We're, we're gonna have to bring him in, and, uh, I mean, we don't have to, but I'm gonna. Okay, the exact same as Logan's feedback, that's funny. Oh, great, great, optimal, and good. And the exact same setup recommended, pretty much. Fair enough. Huh. Alright. 30, and all the way to 1. Mm. Yeah, I mean, that looks about right. Alright, well. Please be swift. Because we want him to get more track time. I think it's like 26 minutes for him to give all five feedbacks, so... Yeah, so 28 minutes should give us enough time, hopefully. I believe uh, Hogger gives feedback uh, a little bit faster than Logan does, so well, he, didn't, he didn't hurt the car, he's fine.
Come on guys, be back a little bit faster, please. I mean, to be fair, if they give us like four out of five uh, feedbacks, that'll tell us if it's better. So. It's so obviously if they give us like four optimals, then we know that obviously it's better than the uh, previous setup. I would just prefer full feedback. Okay, apparently uh, Logan's going to give feedback faster this time. I mean, I guess to be fair, he was out first. 80, come on, man. Apparently we're just going to be stuck at 80 this time. What do you think? Okay, good. He's at 100. Perfect. Okay, so maybe he might be able to get the last 7% uh, before the practice session's over. Uh, Logan, you can just come in just to save the engine and whatnot. Fair enough, 99%, I'm perfectly fine with that. Oh, never mind, 100%. Works for me. Um, Alright, I guess we might as well do Q1 to try new feedback for Logan. Um, good, good. Great, great, and good. Down to three. Up to two, five. That stays the same. Up to 15, and up to seven, five. Uh, no, that's fine. No, 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 no. I almost did it again. I was really hoping in the uh, new one that they would put some kind of like, hey stupid, you're using the wrong parts, you know, but uh, they didn't. It's kind of unfortunate for the people with bad short-term memory like me, but, uh, you know. I suppose it's not their fault that we don't have a good memory. Radio check. Um, go out now. You as well. No point not to with the traffic. Uh, yeah, yeah. By the time they're halfway done, they'll be starting to go out. And if we should so decide, we can send them out for a second lap. But, uh, probably won't need it, given that you know we we still kind of suck. Once that design center is done, though, you know, at the end of the next month, then uh, that'll enable us to have three projects going on at the same time. So we'll uh, we'll start jumping ahead a lot quicker. Especially with that wind tunnel upgrade shortly after the design center upgrade, and then the CFD right behind that. It'll, uh, it'll get there. All right, next season we'll be, uh, you know, we'll be dominating. Oh, yeah, 
yeah, I get, I, that's the only problem with, uh, with going out first. I never know what the time to beat is. Oh, he's going to slow him down a bit. That's unfortunate. It's all right, though. Like I said, we can send him out again if the uh, split between them and the person in front of them is, you know, small. It's realistically, unless they're going to make it to Q2, I don't really care that much. You know, it doesn't... I, I don't know. It doesn't matter how many times you go out in the session, you still get 30 XP. So, if we're not going to qualify for Q2, I don't see any purpose to go out a second time. We're just putting more wear and tear on our engines and whatnot. Seventeen eight. One fourteen. Holy crap, Baskets. That's a whole three seconds. Yeah, he really slowed him down. Uh we'll uh yeah, we'll send him out again when the traffic goes down. Just so he can uh post you know, I mean because three seconds is huge. So uh let's just fast forward until they're at back at the uh good old ranch. How the hell did a hawker get back to the garage first? Um, I'm gonna swap him to a. Should I? Hmm. Uh, I don't know if I want to swap him to a new set of slicks. Uh, because if he does go to Q2, that one will be useless. Um. Let Let's just wait. Let's see what'll. We'll see what's going to happen. If he can ever get back to the garage. What the... What the hell happened there? I don't... We need to retire the car. What happened? He just like pulled over. Oh, okay. No crash happened, no yellow flag, he just stopped the car. Did I use the wrong engines? Is that what it is? Did um lap history? No. So what happened? I'm confused. I have no idea what just happened there. That's, yeah, that's really strange. I don't know what just happened, but, uh, who knows? Maybe he had a heart attack. Either way, it is what it is. Uh, it's the split. Eh. We're fine. We'll, uh, just leave it as it is. I, I, I'm curious what happened with him, but. It appears it's not going to tell me. Oh, did he, did he get a penalty? No, he didn't. So, I don't know what just happened. Here we are, folks. We're back for another day of scintillating F1 action. It's race day. Williams had a good... Oh, maybe somebody got in his way. 
when he was trying to get the pit and he ran out of gas. That would make sense. Um, I don't know. We'll guess that's what happened. That doesn't look... Uh, I hate the blue line because it makes it hard for me to see if it's going to dip below the 30% or not. Can't revert, can I? No, I can't. Eh, whatever, he'll be fine. Whoops. Alright, save. Just in case anything sketchy happens in the race. Now we should have good weather for the race. The drivers are ready and raring to go. It's the Canadian Grand Prix. And it's lights out, and away we go. All right, so same as always, up to 10 laps with the uh, time zone speed, and then we'll uh, fast forward. Apparently it's a hawker race, this race. I mean, to be fair though, that is the, um, that's the difference that 30% makes, right? Like... I'll just come back on the ERS a little bit. Come on, Sergeant. I need you to get at least one pass. I mean, to be fair, his only option is to pass Stroll, but the Alpha Tori is right there, so that's going to make it difficult. His car is significantly better. Or maybe not, looking at their positions. What what the hell happened? Now that I think about it, fucking uh, Alpine is over there in uh, sixth place. I don't know, last season, uh, or last season, ra last time I played as Williams, rather, uh, Norris was doing way better than he is, so, you know, so I don't, I guess it's different every time. Who knows? I'm gonna set him back to normal so he doesn't waste all his ERS. Um, just let him uh, do their thing. I was really happy with the new one to see that they actually implemented more orders. Like I, uh, I believe it was the actually the the most recent video I was talking about. I really hope that they added more uh, interactable like orders for the drivers and such, and they actually did. So it was pretty cool. I haven't looked at anything yet, but uh, I would assume it's probably going to do about as well as the as this one did. But uh, you know, who knows? We'll see. Uh, 
I see Red Bull's making a comeback. So maybe they'll uh, give uh, Ferrari a good challenge for the uh, constructors here. I don't know. I think they're too far ahead now for it to even matter. If I'm being honest. And again, I suppose it depends on how many points that um, first place awards. Oh, I think, I don't know, is it like 32 or something? I'll have to check. Oh, somebody spun. Oh, Leclerc spun. Oh, he's going to get pushed all the way to the back. Oh, that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. I mean, he'll get it back, you know, but it still, you know, sucks for him. I would greatly appreciate it if Logan would pass somebody. I mean, he strolls right in front of you. you your car is basically as good as his. Come on, man, pass him. To be fair, they're, they're significantly beating us in, uh, uh, was it low speed cornering, I believe it was? Good job, Hogger. An okay, now that Alpha Tor is in front of him again, so. It's going to be a hard pass. But hey, I mean, you know, we're we're getting there. We're getting better. Well, it's like I've said in, you know, various episodes, like it's it'll be about race 16 of this season around there somewhere that we'll start really being competitive. And then, uh, you know, next season, I, I promise you, next season we're going to dominate. slowly closing the gap it does seem so oh no and I mean if it's going to be anything like Sonoda's uh, season so far he's going to fuck up at some point poor Sonoda he, he had such a bad season in uh, the last Williams playthrough I did, and he's been having a rough season this season too. It looks like, uh... Hawker's going to maintain that position, which is nice. Even if he's jostling with uh, the telly for it over and over again, you know, it's just more experience for him, so... Hey, Sergeant finally got the pass. And he instantly got passed again. Looks like Aston Martin. 
Captain have just gained a race position. But I mean, he is staying right on his ass, so that's you know, that's all you can ask for. What kind of tires is he on anyway? Oh, he's on softs. Okay, that's why he's having a hard time catching him. Be fine as long as he stays right behind him. You know, once his tires start wearing down, he'll be able to get by him. After playing the new game, now, uh, oh, good, he got the pass. Good job, buddy. Uh, after playing the new game, I, uh, I really wish that uh, this game had the setting where you can tell them to, uh, you know, be a, be like sort of conservative with their ERS usage instead of like not using it at all. That's right. That's right. Don't give up the position. Just, you know, make them fight for it. Set him to standard fuel usage. Some lift and coast will help that. Copy, copy. Okay, you get the pass again, so set him back to balance. Sergeant struggling to catch up. It's unfortunate. Well, you know, it is what it is. It's a shame we couldn't get his setup right, but it happens. I guess to be fair, I, I could have reloaded the save back and just uh, used his 81% one, but uh, you know, it's, uh, it's not what we're about, so uh, we'll just let it be what it is. Alright guys, last lap, so if you're getting passes, then, or uh, rather last lap at uh, times one speed anyway. Oh no, 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 don't give him that position. No, thank you, sir. We don't, uh, we don't give up position, sir. Oh, hey, Sergeant got the pass, good job. Come on, get the pass, man. You got lots of ERS. Wheel to wheel. There we go. Good job, buddy. Back to balanced. Well, like I said, like I've said a hundred times, every pass is ten points. So, hmm, Leclerc still hasn't caught up. That's crazy to me. Oh, oh no, yes he has. There he is, right there behind Hogger.
You'll get by them eventually. Anyway, that's uh, that's our 10 laps. Well, my bad, that's 11 laps now, so we're uh, time 16 in it. Aston Martin with a great play there. They've moved up a place. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't see any pips, so we aren't involved. Whoop, nope, that's not what we want to see. We want to see the crash, not the... Oh, Safety the VCS car. is out. Uh, do I want you to go in? Hmm. Ten laps. Does it tell me how many laps the car is? No, not that. I want this. Um, reports? No. How long is the damn car out for? Oh, here we go. Uh, all drivers, uh, safety car. It doesn't say how many laps for. Yeah, it doesn't say how many laps for us, so, um, I'm gonna say just whatever, stick to the strategy. Well, well, Verstappen's out. Did his own teammate hit him? That's messed up, man. He did, oh. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Well, I mean, that's a guaranteed position for us, so that's good. Um, yeah, uh... We'll just leave Hogger out. I'm not, I'm not gonna bother, uh... Oh yeah, that, yeah. No, that screws, uh, Perez as well. Who knows how long he'll be fixing. Well, this weekend could be a really bad uh, race weekend for uh, Red Bull. Oh, he's out now. Never mind. He'll be alright. I mean, there's tons of laps left. He'll, he'll get his position back. I'm going to uh, stick with my strategy simply because... Uh, with the uh, safety car, okay, yeah, the safety car is ending, so yeah, that it would it wouldn't have been worth it. But also, the tire usage obviously went uh, way down. Yeah, see it spike up there for there. So uh, we'll get be able to get a few more laps out of their tires, so it'll it'll be fine. I'm just going to uh, set them both to overtake for when the no thing ends. Okay, 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 not that much usage. Leave them be and just uh, time sixteen it.
Alright, well, Sergeant's in the 16th now, so it's nice. Um, let's see, um, yeah, so his tires are still better than they're supposed to be, so we can definitely wait for the pit window. Is there pit window overlapping? That's, I mean, it's fine, I'll just make him wait an extra lap. It is overlapping. No, he can wait an extra lap. You can go in, though. No reason not to set him too uh, aggressive. Uh, same for him. No reason not to set him too aggressive as well, because he's going to pit not this lap, but next lap. It's the highest position we've seen all uh, season so far. Oh shit. Well. Well that uh, kind of screws up our season. But uh, you know. I mean it, it really doesn't. Screws up our race, uh, Sergeant is out, that's unfortunate. Oh no! And there's the crash! Mark my words, there'll be questions asked about that later. Aston Martin with a great play there! They've moved up a place! Let's take a closer look. Now we see the Williams here. And that's an off! Yeah, you see what I mean with the uh, time 16 messing the game up? Like, it's it's still... Oh, whoops. Why didn't you guys change them? Idiots. Um, I guess we might as well yeet him in since he's not going to do anything anyway. Um, and, whoops, uh, I want car parts. I don't know why you idiots didn't change that, but, uh, But we'll uh, bring him in and they'll change it. And it's that kind of race, you know? It happens. Oh. That, um, that could work in our favor. Um. We'll um, leave him out for now. Uh, how long till the rain? Four minutes, 50%. Yeah, he can stay out on his uh, hearts for now. He's still got a messed up chassis, but other than that, it's fine. Wow, wow. Apparently it's a uh, crashy weekend. Okay, okay, so the safety car starting. How long? Two minutes to 50%. Um, hmm. Okay, so hear me out. We know the rain is coming. So if I send him in and put, uh, put tire, uh, rain tires on, 
Oh, that's that's right. Then um then we don't have to pit when everybody else pits. And then uh and since the safety car is now out, then that'll make up for the time we'll spend in the pit. Maybe. Who knows? It could all go horribly wrong. Okay, yeah, see, the track is now damp, so they're all going to come in now. And, uh... Come on, show me the split. 30 seconds. Um, okay, so I will set him to full-on uh, giver mode. And, uh... Um, we'll just, I guess we could set him to aggressive for that, and then we'll just, we'll monitor it for a couple laps and see what happens. I don't know how fast they, uh, degrade, so we'll just, uh, yeah, see, they're all gonna pit now, so that's gonna buy us some time to, uh, catch up, and then, uh, the safety car is gonna slow them down anyway. So in theory, we um, should be able to catch up. Yeah, see we're catching up real fast because they're all in the pit. So, they ain't luck, we can uh, get there as they all get out. And then uh, we'll be right behind them. Two seconds. One second. Come on. Okay, yeah, he just came out. Yeah, so the plan worked perfectly. He's right there behind, in front of me. Okay, so we'll send him to overtake. Overtake. Beautiful. Oh wait, yeah, no, there's no, never mind, no, there's no overtaking permitted. I forgot the safety car was out. But it ends this lap, so that doesn't even matter. But the bright side is it's keeping everyone in front of us slow, which means that we have chance to catch up. I know the safety car's ending soon. It's all part of the plan. Beautiful. All right, we're every we're with the pack again. Oh, and they're going in the pit to change tires because uh, it's gonna rain more, so it's gonna they're gonna need wets. All right, let's just set that into neutral since we don't need to overtake. Alright, so that was some mad experience for him, because he just got all those passes, even though technically they were in the pit, it still counts. Alright, so we'll just let him, uh... Do his thing here. I'm um, just gonna fast forward. And there's an overtake from William. Oh, 
That's unfortunate for the guys behind us. They, you know, they all paid it for wets, and now it's uh, the track's not even wet. Happens like that, though. You know, like you gotta adapt to the changing position or positions, um, conditions rather. Let's set you to standard, just to uh, maintain tires. It's unfortunate that uh, Sergeant wrecked out, but you know, it happens. It's gonna hurt his uh, experience significantly, sadly, but uh, you know, it is what it is. Okay, well they all, I guess they just went for a fresh set of tires? That's odd. Now, I know he's not going to keep the positions, but I, I would like him to try to hold on to them as long as he can. Because the defending does give him XP as well. Five percent. Um, do I want to send him in for some slicks? Um, because they're definitely gonna come in. Fuck it, we'll take the gamble. I mean, worst case scenario, we get 17th place. It's it's not the end of the world, you know. Box, box. Seven to go. Oh no, he's already gotten enough passes that uh, he he's probably gonna get good experience for this race, so. And if we're lucky, he'll, uh, oh, okay, never mind, it's, uh, it's raining, so let's, uh, cancel that call in. So you always gotta be on top of it, cause, uh, you know, it's always changing. I'm just gonna times two it though, just to stay in the interest of time. now dry, but what's the chances of rain? 55%. Um, hmm. Push a bit more. Um, uh, I'm gonna say probably stay out, because 55 is significant. So we'll uh, let him stay out and just
wing it from you know if it uh if it looks like it's gonna uh it's gonna stop or not gonna we can uh we can always tell him to go in the pit and a new position just gained by William No, sir. That's our position. I need you to calm down. McLaren, gain a position. It's lucky you got the pass before the uh, DRS got turned off. It's fine, don't worry about it. Keep it at times one just for, uh, you know, final lap. And Simon crosses the line first. He's taken the win. Be great if we could finish this race in 10th. Be nice. Make up for uh, Logan wrecking up. We got 10th place. We got points this race, so that, you know, makes up for uh, Logan wrecking up. A wonderful result here for the Williams driver. It also means we're uh, now on the board for points. So, uh, it's cool. Okay, well you get decent XP at least. Holy crap, basket hogger. It's almost a level up in one race. Alright, and we got uh, 2.5 mil, so that, that actually should put us enough money to uh, upgrade the CFD now, so... I mean, nice. Um, Oh, we want to and congratulate you on exceeding our expectations brilliantly. Perfect, which is good because it means that they're not mad that we wrecked a car. I know one of the cars busted. Uh, manufacturer, two of those, please. Just regulars, fine. Um, it's just the chassis on both that are missing. Yes, everything else has been replaced, it looks like, yeah. Alright, so they'll fix that in a couple days. Number D. Uh, 
you you 48 days for that but that there you go so now our most important facilities are all upgrading oh wow uh, that's good and we still got 1.2 million left so all right um how are our Ten days and sixteen days. All right. Um, how many days do we got till? Oh yeah, we got loads of time to uh, manufacture those chassis. We're fine. Um, that front wing's done the day before the uh, British Grand Prix, so we're gonna have to emergency manufacture those. I mean, we don't have to, but uh, I'm going to. Uh, Alright, well, overall it was a good race, you know, we, uh, Logan wrecked up, so that sucked, but, uh, we got points, so, uh, you know, fair enough, uh, drop a save real quick before I forget. And then, uh, I'm gonna end it here, so, uh, I appreciate you watching, uh, thanks for watching, and, uh, I'll see you next time.